I think I'm nearly almost at the end uh, now. I'm just showing you some of the work that we do outside of ACCA because um, we not only confine ourselves to our built environment, and increasingly, of course, artists want to work outside of the institution, and we want to be responsive um, to that. Uh, and so um, this is a piece by a, a, gr a group, Endeavour, they've broken up since then. Uh, we've done a projection with Jenny Holzer on the side of the building. You might just actually just tap these things through um, pretty speedily now. Um, but yes, as I say, we, we, we wanted to be responsive to the idea that people like uh, to work in groups um, continuously and, and you know, repeatedly, um, that they want to actually go outside of the institutional framework to um, do their practice. Have we lost it? No? Uh, that's okay. Just, just do, you just do whatever you like. Um, <laughs> one of the great things that happened for us, oh, this is, this is just, um, I'm showing you just the last few um, pieces from the, from the very recent new. Uh, this is <coughs> an Indigenous artist, um, Jonathan Jones, who is um, using a, a play of uh, minimalism with uh, his own traditional symbolism. Uh, and you can't see it so well there, but he's actually made a sort of scarification of the wall. And it's a very, very elegant and beautiful project that has many, many layers of meaning in it. Um, these two sort of sticks, if you like, almost like um, message sticks. Uh, a, a very sort of domineering on that wall that's 45 feet high. So those are very, very tall sculptural pieces. Um, you want to tap it through? Anyway, I'll just, yeah. Um, Chris Bond, uh, whose work is, is highly personal and um, quite chaotic actually, but it has this sort of orderliness to it, which is um, quite fastidious. This little box which contains uh, Sandra Selig's um, optical play, which is, um, very nice, this sort of dance of, of light. It's very hard to photograph, but um, when you go into the space, light just sort of bounces around and it's uh, um, produced through a sort of fluorescent paint uh, 